Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. I have another one of those uh, space chilies to review for you guys today and once again sent to me from Jim Duffy of Refining Fire Chilies. And please uh, check him out at superhotchilies.com. Awesome guy. If you need more information on these space chilies or want to find out when seeds will be available, uh, make sure that you contact him. Now the one we're going to be reviewing today is the HJ9. This is called the Big Bang. Uh, just a huge looking uh, pod. This one's green. Now they do ripen to red. I've seen pictures of these uh, completely red as well. Now the seeds uh, were provided to Jim Duffy from Jenny Song. Uh, she's located in the UK. Uh, and I'll put all the information in the description box below. The links to her website is also an informative link on uh, China's space breeding program. Now these seeds uh, are part of that breeding program where China has uh, used recoverable satellites to send these uh, seeds and other types of vegetables up into orbit, subjecting them to uh, anti-gravity and uh, cosmic radiation. And they're really big into this. They're finding that these things become mutated, um, more disease resistant, more nutritious, um, and they've selected the ones that are really mutated and continue to grow those out. Now, Jenny Song did point out recently on Facebook that uh, these are F1 hybrids. Uh, so I know a lot of people are probably going to be interested in growing these after seeing all these reviews that uh, reviewers are doing. Uh, so make sure that you know where you're getting the seeds from, such as uh, Jim Duffy himself. But let's go ahead and get into this one. Uh, once again, the HJ9 Big Bang. All right, here we go. All of these space jellies really have a good flavor on them. They're juicy. This just has your typical mild green uh, chili flavor. And what I do on this review, what I thought I'd do on this review to make it a little bit more interesting is um, this is a Korean hot pepper paste called gochujang. And um, my wife and I, the Koreans, really like to take fresh green chilies and just dip them into here like that and just eat this like this. Mmm. So this is a fermented red chili paste. Uh, sometimes you can <clears throat> put a little vinegar in here and make it a little bit more of uh, not quite as thick, but this stuff is um, not real, real hot, but it's just got that nice fermented red chili pepper flavor. Uh, we use this a lot in Korean cooking. Mm. So far, this is not hot. This is a little bit spicy. This one's just kind of bland to me, not spicy, not bitter tasting or anything, but it doesn't have the, um, the sweetness, get rid of some of these seeds in here, the sweetness or the fruitiness on some of the other ones, uh, but just a real fresh, you know, earthy taste to it. Go ahead and dip a little bit more. This is really a good snack eating it this way. Not as um, sharp tasting as a bell pepper. <coughs> mm, excuse me. Yeah, that one's kind of 
just kind of a bland flavor, just kind of green, regular, um, very mild chili flavor. Uh, but uh, these things are a lot of fun. I think this would be really good to cook with or to grill up um, with sea salt and olive oil, eat them that way. This would probably have been a good one to slice up uh, and you know put on a pizza, grill it up like that. Uh, but this one's for everybody, very mild flavor on this one. Really not too much heat on this one, it's very mild. So once again, that was the HJ9 Big, Big Bang uh, Space Chili from uh, Jim Duffy of Refining Fire Chilies. Uh, for all the questions you guys have on when seeds will be available, please contact Jim Duffy at superhotchilies.com. All right, thanks for sending that, Jim. I appreciate it. Stay tuned for more Space Chili reviews, everybody. And until next time, enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.